helped. It wasn't good, but it helped me be who I am because I know what not to do today. And I tell people, you know, you can't, that's not what you have to do. I have a friend and um, he's still in recovery. You know, best day is after recovery, after AA. And I was, I was telling him and he's like, well, I, it's hard. Nobody said, you know, the easiest thing is, is to get high. It's hard not to. Ask me how I know. You know, even today, after 27 years, it would be easy for me to get high. It's hard. But the easy part for me, I don't want to. Because I know where it's going to take me. Anything that I have accomplished in my life will be poof, out the window. My children's lives, poof, out the window. And you know, when, when I was in that drug thing and getting high, I really thought the only person I was hurting was me. But I hurt everybody in my family. Everything that you do that's wrong affects at least 10 people you know. Your children, your parents, your aunts. Count them 10 off. And then if they come and get high with you, that's another 20 people. But if nobody get high, how wonderful. Could you imagine? You know, I've had parties and um, not, well, I have gone to parties and people are drinking. I'm like, wow. But I don't drink. You know, my son Roland, he gets He'll have a party, and he drank, right? I tell him, Randy, roll, stop. But anywho, if there's a cup, one time, I'll tell you, for instance, one time his friend offered me a beer. He looked at him. He said, man, don't you ever do that. He was offended. <laughs> I was like, wow. And the other day, there was a cup. Somebody must have had something in it, drink or something. And I moved it. Don't you, he looked at her, don't you touch that. I said, Dad, it's a cup, baby. <laughs> but because of what he knows, he don't want me to have any, not even smell. Because he don't want it to be something that would take me out. You know, no matter what he's doing, he's like, no, uh-uh, mm-mm, no, mm-mm, you ain't doing that one. Don't touch that cup. I'm like, boy, <laughs> you know. And it's funny, but it ain't funny, because he be serious. Don't mess with his mama and think, you know, but um, it's about life. I've learned today, I can't do those things. And I don't want to do them, because it took so much. You know, um, when I was younger, I, was not, I wasn't so bad. You know, I was smart, at least I thought it was. But the thing is, I messed up when I thought I, was, thought I was too smart. You know, that I could beat the drugs and, you know, oh, I can handle this. You can't handle that crap. You know, you think about a blackout, waking up, don't know where you went, don't know how you got there, wherever you went. You know, it's like, but you're going to say, oh, I can handle my, I can handle my liquor. No, you can't. Give it up. It ain't where it is. You know. Uh, it took me, I was 41. Oh, you got to ask Quill. I thought it was 40. But 41 before God delivered me. And when I got delivered, it still worked on me. Because sometimes we, you know, we try to give it up. And then, you know, it, it calls you. The enemy's like, come on, one drink ain't going to hurt you. Wow, come on, one hit ain't going to hurt you. And you be on a roll. I know a friend of mine, I told him I, 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 I was clean for eight months. And he said, what hit ain't going to hit you? Ain't going to get to you? Well, three or four years later, <laughs> he was lying. <laughs> so I kind of know that that's not the case. You know, I remember a while, I don't know if I ever told anyone, um, I was over with my sisters and we were having a family gathering. And they had, they were, I wanted a salad. So they had salad. And my aunt was saying, well, we got some, well, the, it was some wine vinegar. I said, no, thank you. And it's like, it ain't nothing but 
I don't care what it is. I ain't drink. I ain't eating it. Everybody's like, you serious? Yes, I'm serious. It said W-I-N-E. What that spell? Why? What I'm allergic to? Why? <laughs> See, I'm allergic to liquor, wine, drugs. I'm allergic to that stuff. And I don't have the capability to take just one. And the fact of the matter, I understand that. It took a long time to realize I have a, I have a disease. And it's called drugs and alcohol. Which means I can't do that at all. You know, not even, no. Mm-mm. No, I'm not doing that. I, I'm not, no, no. I, oh, hold on. My, he's asking me something. There you go again. What? I got a Pepsi. I need some ice. I, can I get some ice? Oh, now you got to check for ice. So don't ask me then. You know, but um, today is a great day. And I'm truly grateful to be here. You know, um, we did have um, call in, but for some reason, the cameraman broke the wire. So all you could do now is text my number, and I could um, text you back, because as you know, I text over 300 people as we, you know, every day, and I text as far as Jamaica, I text all over the country, you know, and when I text people, they text other people, so I don't know how many people exactly, you know. But my number is 203-466-9080. And again, I ask you to go on Facebook. My name, Rosalind Mallory, and um, view and share. And on was it YouTube? It's my best day show, and I need you to subscribe. You know, um, and also I got an extra thing going on. Okay, it's very important to like it on YouTube so that YouTube doesn't cancel me because I need enough. I need enough likes and subscribers so i'm asking you to help me help a sister out i don't know where god is sending this or where this is going but i'm on for the ride i'm i'm on for the long haul because truly i want to empower enlighten and encourage whomever would listen because i've been in the pit of life and it, it's not pretty there. You know, I've been down in the dumps. You know, and I'm not saying I'm anywhere better than anyone else today. But my life is better than it was. He wants me to put the thing down, right? Let twist the tea and put ice in the glass. Could you do that for me, please? Well, wash your hands. Well, turn it upside down. No, I'm trying to encourage him, but he's not listening. I know, I, Lord Jesus, I don't know, Lord. You you see this? I'm on, I'm on, you, I'm on video, right? You know, I tell you, it's live. These are things that you go through in life. People be doing stuff. You like? Am I? Thank you. No, I'm good. But you know, you see how it is? I don't know what makes. I got my own drink. You know. Pepsi, that is. Um, that's the way life is. You know, people just, that was crazy, right? What you think? He come out and say, give me some ice. He bring that ice straight to my, he washes the glass, brings in the ice and say, I don't want to touch the ice. Huh? What is that? <laughs> Stuff like that comes from everywhere. <laughs> that's how my day has been done. <laughs> but again, I'll be okay. You know, life is good, <laughs> you know. Better be clean. Yeah, better be clean than have that coat. Oh, they said, um, what's that the virus that's going around? Yeah, coronavirus. coronavirus, but African or yeah, the, we can't catch it. Uh-huh. 
Don't drink Corona beer. Why? Shut up. <laughs> don't drink. Don't tell my son that. Don't drink Corona. Shut up. <laughs> you know, I, could you open that, please? You know, he's like, I think he's on. Uh, <laughs> you drinking today? You drinking? You know, but um, he's a good guy, but he got a little, he got a little spots that we got to clean up on. You know, but um, I'm like grateful to that, you know, and um, as I said, I don't know what God is up to, but I understand that God is up to something. And if you didn't, today is Friday and we're going to do this today and we're going to do it again tomorrow, right? Yeah, we're doing two days a week. I don't know where that, that came from the cameraman. He always trying to do something, but... Things that we're led by. Okay, hold on. Hold on, guys. This is my grandson. Let me see. Aquil. You know I'm on FaceTime. I mean, I'm on my show today. Ooh. Yeah. Is he on there? Oh, okay. But I'm on the show talking right now. Y'all just... He said he don't need to hear... See? People like that make people like me want to get down and just get busy. What? So, you want to hang up then? I'm on, I'm on live. I can't put the phone down, put the mic down and talk to you. You see, one people, let me tell you, Aquil is, has a control issue. He has a control issue trying to tell me what I'm supposed to do with what I'm doing because I'm talking to him. <laughs> I, I don't know, Crow, but I'm busy. Where are you right now? Oh, and my daughter and his mama's in it too. Where your mama? Oh, my granddaughter. Hello? They just... Because I'm on the show. No, I'm on the show and talking to you. You see, you see what I I go through. I'm the adult, and they talk to me like they're my child. I'm their child. Say that again. Layla said that it's unprofessional that you're doing a show when you're on the phone. Layla's 13, and she took us to Chili's, so I'm not listening to her. We were, <laughs> I put that on blast. <laughs> Layla's 13. Um, I do my show every Thursday at 6 o'clock. She is my role doll. Huh? Oh, no, I do best day every day at 6 o'clock. Go ahead. Oh, now they know. Okay, bye. Bye. Okay, see? Layla is, she's 13, she's smart. She don't talk that much. But um, she, when she does, it's smart mouth. But um, ev every Thursday, 6 o'clock, I'll call, I'll call her before then. I say, you coming? Yeah. She likes Doritos, you know, because I buy, um, right now I buy summer sandwich meat. And, you know, she's a real picky eater. You know, parents know about people like that, right? She don't eat cheese. She don't eat nothing. No mayonnaise. No nothing. Just, oh, there's my cameraman. There he go. I don't like it either. You know, but okay. But um, she always got a, she always got a point. You know, but I'm grateful. Um, she used to go to church with me on Sunday. Now she only comes to the meeting. But something is better than nothing. We have to teach in the in the years of Abraham and Isaac and things that we, people that we read about in the Bible. They taught their children about God. Where are we doing that? If you're not, why not? You know, if you don't believe in God, what do you believe in? Do you want a better life? Start believing. I'm telling you. Somebody that been there. You know, people. some people's like, I, I was raised in the church. 
And then you raised in the church and you go away from the church, then you come back. That's just a cycle that we do. And then people go to church and you know what? There's some mean rascals in church. But the thing is, God can change their heart. And I've seen it time and time again. You know, because I know I could be a, a meanie if I chose to. But I'm learning that I don't have to be a meanie. The Bible says that God will make your enemy your footstool. I've seen that. You know, I've seen where people, like, they just, just mean. And, um, oh, he just gave me the two-minute finger. That means I got two moments. But anyway, they changed. You know, it, I didn't, I wasn't being back. I talk junk. I'll do that now. But um, I'm not going to be mean to people because you never know what someone has gone through to get where they are. Like, I got up three, th you don't know what I went through getting where I'm at. It was tough. But I haven't been mean to anybody. I lick my tongue at them. Nah, you know? But they could deal with that. You know? And I laughed. And I had fun. You know? But um, life, he told me, one minute. So with the one minute, we're going to close out in prayer. Remember, my best day show. What is it? On YouTube, I need you to like and subscribe and share on f Facebook. He's got me so messed up. Uh, you, you share on f YouTube too? To Facebook. Oh, share to Facebook. Does that sound confusing? We need a lot of likes on, on, on YouTube. They need to know that you're actually listening or looking. Just like if you don't look. <laughs> I love it. But anywho, our Father, which art in heaven, how would be thy name? Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil for that is the kingdom the power and the glory forever and ever amen glory i don't know how much time i got now am i done okay take care everyone <laughs>